strike, or uh, Utah strikes. Wow, they're that much? Yeah. I thought maybe they were 75. Nope. like that in my bike racing days back when I used to be on TV a lot. Yeah. They would have race coverage and all that kind of stuff, you know. Yeah. Hey, I know you. I don't know you. Those ladies. Is everybody back there? Uh, one or two more coming around the corner. All right. I saw Paul at the trip close across, but still Oren and uh, Steve were back there. All right. Okay, there's one of them. That's Paul. Oh, and they're up on the curve. Okay, we're all here, I think. All right. Yeah. And they're all cat strikes too, so I guess it's kind of yeah. like a herd of cats. <laughs> Give or take a couple of ices. Yeah, that's true. There are a few different ones.
I'm going to try and keep everything in alignment, keep my butt straight. I feel it more here. Yeah. On the inside. Yeah. On both legs. <laughs> Probably not using that muscle. Actually, you're overusing. Is that what it is? Yeah. Because it has an effect. No, because it's not supposed to be used that much. Other muscles are supposed to pick up the slack. If I'm getting a strain on the inside of both, what's that tell you? Is it my core straight? Or? Core, serratus muscles in between your ribs. Yeah. Spinal erectors, inner and outer abdominals, hip flexors, huh. outer quads. Quad means four. Four heads. <laughs> You're overusing the inner one. Okay, this is ridgeline go be going right. Well, let's wait for this guy. Alright. Probably gonna wait for the crew. Let's let's go around the corner a little bit. We'll wait here. We'll grab this, some shit. Grab some shade right here. Yeah. We'll wait, up, we'll wait up for everybody here for the downhill. The one thing that I found though is if I I try to every once in a while remember and just kind of get my butt up out of the seat. Mm -hmm. Just because I think I lose blood flow. Like my legs will start, oh, yeah, start starving com compressing a Compressing too much tissue. Yeah. So I kind of like get up a few times and then rearrange and settle down again. And that seems when I used to have my windsheet, that, that was a bad problem for me because it had that carbon fiber seat with yeah. open cell foam so yeah. it would crush out. And I realized my whole butt is numb. Yeah. And my power would go down. Yeah. It's like I could not shake that. I tried to move around. I tried drilling holes in it because it get pulls the sweat in the bottom. Yeah. All kind of stuff. I was at the point where I was gonna, before the frame broke, I was gonna get one of those anatomically curved seats and replace it with, with that. Uh-huh. You know, with the uh, closed cell foam. But that was that was annoying well, yeah, as hell. I, think I I I'll start getting probably just oxygen starvation or too much lactic acid built up if I don't make sure the circulation's still working there. <laughs> okay, there's the last man. <laughs> okay, big downhill. See you at the bottom. <laughs> Beast mode. Dragon Slayer. This starts off kind of gradual, and then about halfway through, there's a real nice percentage grade drop. Okay. Thank you. 